there's a day who comes in handy with the sun who starts to grow and the others getting bigger while a mommy holds the show it's the daily davison show daily davison show i'm just sitting here with carter he's sleeping I'm gonna wake him up in a second to nurse him again. Oh, that sweet baby. Sweet babies. I'm still so tired. I still I have not slept. I've taken like maybe like a few cat naps since having him, and since yesterday, uh, I started contracting at five in the morning, and then yeah, I took a nap one time yesterday. So I'm so tired, y'all. When we got here at 10 o'clock last night, 10 p.m., I didn't sleep for real at all. So I'm so exhausted. But I don't want to. I don't want to send him back to the nursery to take to take a nap because I just I just want him in here with me. Oh, he just smiled. So, but I know I probably should get a little bit of rest. So maybe after I eat, um, I'll try to. I'll send him back to the nursery and take a nap. And uh, take advantage of that nursery time. Oh gosh, I'm so tired. Good morning. It's the next day. <clears throat> um, last night was pretty good. Ouch. I, they, they, uh, Carter slept in the nursery and they brought him back to me like maybe like once or twice throughout the night. Um, to nurse him and he did good they brought him to me this morning and i nursed him um but now he's doing like his hearing test and all that stuff now in back of the nursery and i just got finished eating breakfast there's nothing on there but um uh i had a bagel and i had some yogurt and now i'm getting ready to take a shower because they are supposed to let us go home today they claim that they're gonna let us go home so i hope they do because i'm not getting any sleep well i i got sleep but i'm not getting i'm not comfortable in here like i just want to be in the comfort of my own home so i'm waiting for them hopefully it'll be around lunchtime maybe i don't know i'm not sure when they're gonna let me go but hopefully soon and plus the battery on here is not charged i don't have the charger and tj's got at home with him he's at home um editing vlogs and taking care of the boys because yesterday my mom and, and my stepdad they had tickets to go to the funny bone obviously before they didn't know i was gonna go into labor that day so TJ had to go back home anyways with the boys <clears throat> to take them. So that's what he's doing. And he's gonna come back up here and pick me up later on. As long as they give me the, the okay to go home. So I can't wait. I'm gonna take a shower real quick and um, try to walk around and stuff. Cause they told me to walk around to, I guess, help things or whatever. <laughs> Good morning guys. It's actually evening for me right now. It's like one o'clock or something like that. And I am out of it. Last night I went to sleep at like 2.30ish. And Chance is sitting on the table. Oh Why do you feel like you can do this? You get in trouble every time you do it. I did purple. Every time you do it, you get in trouble. I did purple. No, you're not getting in trouble. Yeah, I've been editing all morning. I was editing all night. And what's crazy is, okay, I didn't have a set time that I was gonna put the, the vlog up, but I had a uh, I had a, a pretty good idea, but I didn't factor in the fact that I would be watching the boys at the same time. So I had I had both of them. Of course, I was cooking them breakfast, and then I was cooking. I had to make them lunch, and then you know a couple snacks in, in between. <laughs> Help them with whatever they need, chance of a couple of accidents. But it's not like, I, I, I didn't try to do it like a regular vlog. I tried to put a little bit more extra effort into it so that um, I can fit in as much information as possible into the vlog and um, it not be like super duper long. So I ended up having like an hour and a half of footage. If you ever edited a video before, going through an hour and something, hour and 30 minutes of footage and figuring out what's useful and figuring out what's not useful. Daddy, um, <laughs> you need to calm down. You wanna say hi? Hi. 
I think it's time for you guys to take a nap. For some reason, kids don't like naps, but they they usually do a pretty good job when I tell them to, to come and lay down. They usually do they'll do a pretty good job about doing that for me because they know I don't play that. That you don't play around. Sometimes they cry and stuff. I don't know if your kids do that, but kids love to not sleep. And if you're a kid, why not get as much sleep as you can possibly get? Because when you get my age, you ain't gonna have no sleep. All right, get in bed, get in bed, get in bed. I'm not. Nope, you're not gonna have any sleep when you get older. Yeah, mm -hmm. go ahead, take a nap, okay? All right, you go take a nap too, okay? Clean up. I haven't ate today yet. That's just how my day has been going. I understand that people are kind of waiting patiently and stuff. And uh, trust me, I try to try to do it as fast as, fast as possible. But I also didn't want to, you know, have you wait for something that you shouldn't have had to wait for. So I want to make sure there was enough content in there and you guys got the whole story. I was telling Tiff, like, we're not trying to have a surprise. It's not like a surprise. The surprise was, you know, us finding out. But as far as is like the the vlog and the video we rather it have been an experience than you know you guys just like oh it's a boy through text i'd rather you feel like you were there and you found out that it was a boy and we just wanted to be more of an experience and, and feel more like you guys were there with us so here i go try to brag about chance and the boys Jaden. i just was bragging about them being good about nap time with me I go in there, Chan is coloring on the blind with the green crayon. <sighs> but anyway, this is my task for right now. I have to learn how to do this thing again. Shout out to uh, to this company. I, f I feel like Tiffany did a pregnancy vlog and they actually uh, supplied this for us, which is cool. I didn't realize like why, I always ask my parents like how do you forget how I was as a child? My oldest is four and I, I don't remember like what we did with these these carrier things like <laughs> I mean I remember what we did with them but I feel like every time I have a new kid it's like learning how to put these things together all over again. It's not like riding a bike. It's not. Even with holding the baby. Just trying to get used to holding a baby that feels so fragile it's just it's not not normal. So Tiffany bought this little car seat canopy thing. I swear we have everything Chevron right now and I don't think we even need all this Chevron. This is a Chevron baby. We should have named the baby Chevy or Chevron or whatever. Yes, I'm gonna try to put this thing together. I think I did it right, I don't know. We finally get to go home. There's my uh, husband back there. Busted, yeah. I had to fill out a bunch of paperwork and stuff like that. But anyways, Baby Carter, I'm here. I wanted to put a little outfit on him, but TJ said we just need to put him in there and go. Yeah, there's no point. So for the third baby, you don't you don't put no outfit on, on him for the baby. Because he gonna go home. Yeah, but he don't need an outfit. Okay, see me. He does need outfit. Yeah. You just don't want to disturb him, is what you're saying. Oh, we need to, we need to try to get some of our blankets out of there. Tito trying, to, Tito trying to take the blankets from the hospital. Blankets, right? Lord, mercy. But no, but we do so, seriously need to get the stuff out of here. The stuff, the diapers and stuff they provide for us. Thank you, everybody who, you know, was being patient and stuff with us. Um, I think we did a good job as far as timing. TJ got the video up within like 24 hours of me having the baby. Um, and plus he still had to be, you know, a dad and stuff to date and chance. Um, you know, feed them breakfast and tend to them and edit uh, over an hour worth of footage and stuff. So thanks to my husband, y'all. This is, this is me and them just saying thank you to you. For doing oh yeah. Yeah, we're getting ready to go home and get to take this little baby's home. The boys aren't even home. They're with Brittany and Sabrina. Or not Brittany and Sabrina. Oh, they are. Yeah, with Brittany and Sabrina. Uh, Brittany is Sabrina, the girl who was in delivery room's um, sister. So, yeah, we'll vlog when we get home to show you guys Carter's first time seeing his new home. I'm just rewriting it. Yeah, I'm just rewriting it. 
He's gotta write a check. He gotta write a check for birth certificates, y'all. He's in the he's in the car seat and he's upset. I know, let's go, you play around. I know, I know, I know. So we are horrible parents. We're sitting out here. No, I, no, I don't want to be we because I was in the, in the hospital. We are one. What are you talking about? Okay. You you scheduled this thing. <laughs> so Sabrina picked up our kids, and then we switched Car. the cars. But I forgot to give her to take my keys. But I also was thinking that her mom was gonna be here, so she decided that she is going to go home and she locked the door when she left so yeah Jaden asked just now if you could hold him. So, you ready? You ready, Jay? You ain't paying attention. Here comes your, here comes your little brother. He wants to watch the fire. I thought you wanted to hold Carter. <laughs> you got him? Yeah. What are you doing? Gentle, okay? Give him a kiss. Good job. You got them all by yourself. All right, now we'll see you tomorrow. Nice. See, you can take care of them for the rest Change of the day. Change drinking okay? my water. Okay. He's okay. <laughs> Guys, last night was uh, 
was a lot. We were trying a lot of stuff to try to get him to go to sleep. Uh, I was telling her how much she, uh, how much I guess tell she loves doing this with a newborn and stuff. It doesn't matter how many kids you have, when you got a newborn in the house, everything changes for real. Yeah. It's crazy. Like, I felt like a new parent all over again. <laughs> I didn't know how to change his. I didn't know how to change his diaper. And I'll be quiet though, and I'm gonna end this vlog. So, uh, thanks guys for watching, and I uh, will see you in the next vlog. Um, leave a nice comment. Peace. Yeah. Give him a kiss. No.